welcome to the vlog. We are going to the beach today. So we thought we'd just bring you along and show you what it's like to get ready with a baby and take a one-year-old to the beach. It's our first time going to the beach since lockdown too, so that will probably be a little bit different. The time at the moment is half past eight, so we're giving Rudy some toast and some raspberries and then we will start getting ready and get on the road. Are you excited to go to the beach, baby? Go, 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 go. <laughs> Got loads of laundry up there to put in as well. Here we go. <gasps> he keeps throwing his food and we don't know what to do about it. <laughs> I've heard the best thing to do about when they throw food is to kind of ignore it and distract them a little bit rather than if you give a reaction they know that you're more likely to not want them to do it again. Uh oh. Yeah. Uh oh. Uh oh. Do you not want your toasty anymore? No. No? Okay. So we're just going to finish up breakfast and then we'll show you how we get ready. Okay, so this is what we've got ready so far. I've got a picnic packed lunch here. So I've just packed a drink, a smoothie, some kitty crisps and a biscuit or some smoothie melts just for snacks during the day because what we'll probably do is get fish and chips or something actually at the beach. And then I've packed this wetsuit for Rudy. It's the Splashabout Happy Nappy wetsuit. So in here, then it's actually concealed. So if you put a disposable nappy on underneath, and then with this on top as well, it will be really tight around him and there'll be no leakages or anything. Also, it's got the uh, SPF protection in it. So it should be good for protecting him from the sun as well. And then also I've got this reusable nappy that I can put on underneath this one, if I prefer to use this one than a disposable one, um, so you can use those together. Then I've just packed a muslin for when he eats lunch, he gets quite messy, spare clothes and bibs, talcum powder because it's great for getting the sand off of you when you're at the beach, just the nappy changing bag in there as well. And then on the side I've put in some paracetamol because I've got quite a headache this morning, the Hawaiian Tropic hydration, SPF, sun lotion, and then I've got Rudy's Child's Farm at 50 plus SPF sun spray. And um, Rudy's just watching YouTube whilst we're about to now finish off doing all of the little bits so that we can actually leave. We've also got loads of different towels with us because we thought you could never have too many. So we've got Rudy's one that can just go over the top of him with a hood. A couple of adult beach towels and then we've got Rudy's beach towel that somebody got him for his birthday, one of my good friends. We made it out the house, we are in the car, it's going to take about an hour and a half to get there. We're going to go to the Southbourne Beach which is just down the road from Bournemouth Beach. Have you ever been there before? I haven't either so it's all new for all of us. Rudy's falling asleep in the back already. So hopefully he'll have quite a nice nap now until we get there. I think we're going to stop off for a coffee and a snack as well, which we always do at Starbucks. In the Starbucks drive through There, there, there. Mm. Oh, I forgot that they're doing the blonde roast as well. Breakfast roll. Mmm. I wonder if that means they're doing the paninis, or is it just like a breakfast menu? Mm. Uh, we've just decided what we'd do if we won the lottery, because um, we were talking about the people in the UK that won the lottery and then didn't spend any of their money on hardly anything. So we're going to buy 10 um, Toyota Priuses and then we're going to rent them out <laughs> to the Uber drivers. Uber drivers. And that's probably get a dog and then we'd actually and then we said we'd buy a really cool thing for every person in our family as well 
So now we're thinking we might do the lottery tonight. And then if you get the app, you can. So get it now. Yeah, get it now. If you get the app, you can literally just tap in the days that you do it and your numbers or lucky dip, and then it does it automatically. Well, you it's on the advert. It says that you can never forget to do the lottery if you do it on the app, so you can never miss out on being a millionaire. Got to be in it to win it. Got to be in it to win it. Nearly there. So yeah, we'll definitely do the lottery tonight because. Never know. So we got <laughs> not much left of it now, but we got the cinnamon roll, all day breakfast bun, Dan got the caramel frappuccino with coffee, and I got the Caramel macchiato, blonde roast, tall, skinny. Does anyone else find that your Starbucks order just takes an absolute age to order? So it's a tall, skinny, caramel macchiato, blonde roast, and then if they don't hear one part of it, then it's all gone wrong. But, got our drinks. We're here, we made it. Baby, are you excited that we're here? Say woohoo! Only took us about 10 million hours to get here, but we made it. slept all of the way home which was amazing and we had a really nice day we played on the beach he played for ages and didn't get as bored as I thought he would as quickly as I thought he would by the time we left he was just shattered because I don't know I feel like the air the breeze that comes at you and the fresh air it just makes you so tired so as soon as we put him in the buggy we hadn't even left yet and he'd fallen asleep which is good the social distancing was actually fine there was lots of space on the beach when we went and got the lunch it was all divided really well and then we ate our food at a bench and Rudy was in his high chair uh, sorry he wasn't in his high chair he was in his push chair and that worked really well so all in all it was an amazing day it's just so nice to see everybody out and about again I guess and doing things that they like to do rather than all being cooped up at home so it was so refreshing to just get away and we had a great day so please give this video a big thumbs up if you liked it i'm going to be doing more family things home content and a little bit of lifestyle maybe fashion beauty kind of upload so if that's your kind of thing please do subscribe and i look forward to doing the next video i'm really loving this so far so thanks for watching see you later bye